yes, my people, you know, me there upon the beach side, you know, you know. Yeah, man, me just roast the fish them, just grill them at home. Yeah, man, and the main reason why me come here, two main reasons. Yeah, man, carry me, me, me little daughter, and, you know, carry my family come all a swim. Yeah, man, and the second thing, Karan the last him knife yesterday, because we go dive in the afternoon, you know. In the evening yesterday, and you know, night catcher and current the last him knife in the shallow right here. So, him can't come because he have work. So, me decide to come and circle and see if I can find him because I right in the shallow. And you know, me bring me small spear gun. So, I go try to see if I can catch something in the meanwhile. And me also bring me, me jerk pan as well. So, you see this setting. I try to see if I can find a few. Dinner size fish anywhere in the shallow or on the reef where we can do a little roast with on the beach because a long time we don't really do an outdoor cook. Yeah man and it's great for know say yeah. Me and my family there so at the right time, you know so yeah man the sea is a little choppy choppy right now because I in the midday you now and I know say earlier on it would have flat and up in the evening it would flatter. But it's clean. And I can see say it's well clean, so I go work with it. Wind the pan it. So I go out here go so we can find, you know? Yeah man, so just go and watch what I've won. So this was in the shallow, the water was okay and that was a conga tony or a squirrel fish. I was trying to get a shot on it but it was moving too fast. So this was the first shot I took. It was a quab, it tore off the spear. So right here I saw some surgeon fish, I was following them. I didn't want any surgeon fish though. I was searching for quab, snappers, gold tail, red belly and even grunt. The squirrel fish would do as well. But trying to spear something with this gun is even harder than I thought. It's been a while since I used such a small gun. Here's our next quab. I missed that one. I guess the spear gun was too slow. So right here I saw a huge jack, a bar jack. I was trying to attack it. But it wouldn't come any closer though. It was just deer swimming around. It was definitely in range for the longer gun, but not the short spear gun. I was in the shallow for a little time and I realized that I wasn't seeing anything 
only a few small fish. So I head for the deep. On the way there, I came across this small school of jack. I was trying to spear the bigger one, but they were moving too fast for me. So this was the first fish, a quap. And here is on top of the reef. I dive to check that hole out. When I looked up, I saw these few butter jacks heading towards me. So I took the biggest one. And remember that today's dive is just to get a few fish that I can cook on the beach. But I still have my chalk line connect to my spear gun. So if I get any big fish encounter, I can spear them as well. A big snapper was right here, but it saw me and head for the deep. This was our next squirrel fish. This one will do just fine. It's been a while since I eat one of these. They taste real good, but they are hard to handle. So I catch a few fish that I feel satisfied. I head back to the shallow. I came across this flounder and he showed me the way out of the water. Yes, my people, so me jump out of the water. Yeah, man, and you know, place get a little darkish, you know, the sun gone. Overcast too as well, like rain I go fall. Get real dark. You know, girlfriend says she don't feel good, so you know look like me I go bad at do no, no, no cook up on the beach. Long time I do a cook up still, you know, but why? Look like it I got up again. Yeah man, you know. Oh, look a gun, make you go and see with me. You look a gun. Everything I shoot with the gateway. Everything I shot get with me. I find five fish, I find two jack, a red belly, and a quab up there. So I find a kanga tone. Or a squirrel fish. Some people call them kanga tone, some people call them bulla head. Some people even call them wrench man. Look a red one there, a long time you know eat one. Yeah, man. So you know me I go clean off them here. Yeah. And you know we eat the room because jerk one day about I got magic.
Yes, my people, so you know, I'm a little, little dynamic, you call it this, you know. I'm a nice little fish, you know. And I'm not finding a knife at all. No, I'm going to search, at two times I'm going to search for a knife, and I don't know if I can see. So, I don't know if I'm going to get one next knife. So, you know, I eat that. So, yeah, I do, man. You know, I did one with the cook up. But, your friend says she doesn't feel good. So, I go eat the road, you know? Yeah. So, but, um, when I go home, I'll try to try do something. Try, you know? Fry them and do a little cook down on them. So, stay tuned for that scene, you know? alright? Yeah man, maybe one, maybe one next day I come and try to see if we can, you know, do a catch and cook on the beach. So, we are hit the road, you know. Yes, my people, so these are the fish, a little bit more clearer. Yeah man, just reach home, man, you know. The local catcher may have the little uh, five fish. Yeah, man, you know, well clean everything. So, you know, do a local dinner cook up with them because I do want to cook them on the seaside. Never work out, unfortunately. Yeah, man, so you don't know, say, I go do a little. Yeah, man, I go brown shoe with them, fry them, and then cook them down my brown shoe style. And, yeah man, with piece of yellow yam yeah, man, you know piece of the yellow yam there me up there, you know. And um two finger banana see me. Yeah man. So you know, me just get piece of the yam off of this. As me mentioned in the first video. Yam plant a one bad place, so you know mess it up when it grow. Yeah man, yam in the pot already me have had the banana, you know. Mm. Yeah, my boy, you know. I got fit in two dumplings as well, because you know the thing set. Well, everything they are packed, you know, banana, yam, and dumpling, you know. Yeah, man. You know? mm. So, I go on and my people, some slicing of them and some seasoning on them. So, I ready them up for the pot, you know. Them ready for the pot, I go hot up the aisle with them, you know. Because I say, I'll give them a little fry then put them down back, you know. So, I hot up the aisle, you know, and then start the ball of the road. See it look them people. Yeah man, them well done, you know. Well cooked. Well, well cooked my people. So you know, everything ready. Next part lock off already. So I'm gonna do look a shear out here now. Yes my people, so you know, just 
She wrote the little dinner here, you know, because you don't know. One dumpling, piece of yam, three finger banana, two of the fish. So the thing set. You don't know. Yeah, man. So, I was so a one for this year, no? Yeah, man. The dive was great in the afternoon there again. In the evening, I was there again. Yeah, man. You know, you no know, find no big fish. Although, I never have that in mind still. Because uh, the little gun I did have, although the little gun could have more than shoot big fish see a lot of big fish but me can couldn't take any shot from so far yeah so me catch where me could you know so and do at least then cook up so once more my people thanks for watching as always and now tap say share up the video with your families and friends and nasa links do see you guys in the next video all right